Hello, 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 everybody. I'm Christy with Christy's Craft Room. I'm not. That is my husband, Tim. He is sending out the text message right now for everybody. And we are trying something new today. I don't know if it's going to work. Craft room. I don't know if we're going to love it. I don't know if we're going to hate it. But um, we're trying something new nonetheless. So y'all um, come on in. Let us know how you're doing today. We're going to make a really, really cute birdhouse craft. Um, but let me get this pulled up on here so I can see um, what we got going on here, okay? All right. So come on in. Come on in. Let us know. Can you hear us okay? Do we have um, what sound? Did we set up sound? I don't <laughs> we know. We knew we were forgetting something, y'all. Can you hear us? Of course, we're going to forget something, y'all. Um, so come on in. Say hey. Give us a minute. Show us some grace. We're trying something new. Um, we're trying to bring you guys in a little bit closer, trying to give you guys a better view. Um, we'll see what happens. We are live both on Facebook and YouTube with two cameras, okay? So you can see our faces, and we can still interact, and it still, still feels personal and, and, you know, like we're connecting. But then you can also get a better view of the craft in front of me, hopefully. That's the plan, okay? So let us know what you think about it. Let us know if you can see, okay? We put my face at the bottom so that the comments wouldn't be covering the craft at the top. So um, we're just trying it. We, we can bounce things around. We can change things up. We can play with it over time. Um, so we shall see. Yes, you guys can hear us. Okay, Tammy says she loves this idea. Awesome. Um, having a good day. Yes, I can hear you. And okay, the setup is good today, Miss Dorothy. The setup is good. Hello, Miss Candace. Hello. And it actually, um, I look pretty clear. Do I? It's not. I know it's so weird, y'all. We're not glitching and freezing like we've been. But I did do something different, and I'll tell y'all what I did different. And um, it's so probably obvious. And I think that could be solving that one it, issue. Um. But once we get fancy, we could always like bop it around like to different camera views too. But we figure right now, oh, it is doing like that focus thing on the overhead. It was just trying to focus. So we'll see. If I, as long as I oh. don't move my hands too much, that might be the issue. Um, all right. We're going to get crafted and we're going to see how this goes. Okay. So today it's so weird for me to look at it this way though. Um, it is different. Yes, it's different. It is. Um, we are using the new camera and the old camera so the new camera is the overhead view and the old camera is the face view so we'll see how it goes okay hello miss uh, bernita all right so today we are using we have two um what are these called y'all um palettes little palettes from dollar tree I have two construction shims. It's weird holding it down here and not up here to show y'all. Oh, it's so weird. It's going to take me a minute to get used to this. I have some Jenga blocks from Dollar Tree. And I have our little cute little birdhouse set from our shop. Okay, it's got the little wood birdhouses with the little galvanized, um, the galvanized roofs, roofs, roofs roofs, whatever they're called, the galvanized roofs, okay? Um, and we're gonna paint these up and we are going to make a birdhouse tower or a birdhouse amendium or a birdhouse sky scraper, okay? We're gonna make, we're gonna stack them all up, okay? And we're gonna hope and pray that this works, okay? And hopefully you guys have a big enough view and you can see all the things. Okay. Mom, mom and, and dad, dad are, are here. here. Hey, mom and dad. Are we coming in okay? So, we looking okay? Dad, is, is the TV still working good? <laughs> is the TV coming in good? Is it all coming in good? We're going to start with our birdhouses, and then we'll kind of lay it all out to attach these, Um, because I'm not really sure how long I need them to be. So we're going to start with the birdhouses. We're just going to paint them super, super simple, guys. It's going to be... um. It's gonna be should be a pretty easy craft. Should be, should be and is are two different things, right? But my plan it should be okay. Yeah, technology should be pretty easy, right? Everyone's but it's saying not. hi to mom and dad. Okay, so our cute little birdhouses. I'm gonna to want to separate. We have two that have heart That's holes and two that have round this, holes. So I'm gonna want them to kind of be this, separate. This, this. So we'll maybe. 
don't know what that was. What was that noise? It was like a ringing. Yeah, it was like was that a... us. Was that you? Oh, that was me. That was you. Tim's making noise over here. Well, it was sitting on this sounding board too. Tammy says, I'm so excited. Myself and my sister will be at KCR 2024. I'm so excited too, Miss Tammy. I'm so excited. I know you were so heartbroken when you couldn't go last year, but Tammy was able to scoop up a ticket, two actually, and um, she is going to be joining us. So super, super exciting. All right. So first, let's get to it. I'm just like talking and not even crafting. And that's what we do sometimes around here. <laughs> that's what we do. I'm going to grab a paper plate and we are going to get some paint. I have Nightfall Blue. Yes, there is supposed to be, a, a, it is supposed to be a split screen. We're trying something different. We are, yes. We have two different views. Y'all tell us your opinion. If you like it, you don't like it. If it's a headache and we hate it, we won't do it. Okay, I'll just be honest with you. Um, but if it's it's not too bad for us to set up and y'all like it and everything comes in clear, we'll continue to do it. So just let us know how it's looking, how you're liking it. Um, we're just trying something new and we're gonna see how it goes. We're gonna see how it goes. Oh, Miss Lynn says she doesn't like it. Lou doesn't like it. Linda doesn't like it. Mary doesn't like it. Oh no. Well, but Nancy Linda says it's gonna it. take some getting used to, but it, it is, might be pretty nice. It is different. It is a different view. Um, you know, it is just different. So we're gonna we'll we'll we'll, we'll play with it and see if we like it. Um, it is at least the vertical screen, so it's not tiny on your phone. So we're still filling your phone screen, which was really important to me. Nancy says, "I like it. I like it." And with the with with her face at the bottom and the craft at the top, you shouldn't have to worry about comments covering it up no more right. and that was one of the biggest reasons why we've never done the split screen in the past was because um i've seen other people join it and um i've seen people complain because they can't read the comments because it's cut or they can't see the craft because the comments are covering it um and things like that. Or when it was long ways, they'd have to turn their phone and it would like, I don't know, it, it wouldn't fill the screen and people would complain. I don't know, but we're trying it. We're trying it. Brenda says she loves it. Dorothy says she likes it. Love it. Um, love it might be better <laughs> if face was on the top. Afternoon. I think I like it. Tim got me excited earlier. I was thinking you were live, but only for five seconds. Yeah, Tim, um, you guys, I'm gonna start by putting a base color of each of these. I have three, co four colors, okay? I've got Nightfall Blue. I've got Blue Heaven, which is the lighter. That's the Nightfall Blue. We've got Sunshine, which is the little bit lighter Thank you, yellow. Patty, for the stars. And then we have Hi, Empire Gold, okay? So we've got all these different colors. Um, and if you sprinkle this video, we are going to gift one of these sets to somebody who's watching right here today. So share this video. Um, let us know in the comments that you did and we'll get somebody picked this afternoon. Okay. Well, today, right here now, like this afternoon, <laughs> right now, because it is this afternoon. <laughs> Y'all listen. Shut up and craft. Y'all, it's been a day. Y'all, it's been a long day. It's been a really, really long day. Actually, earlier today, I was there was some stuff I was working on, and I walked into Christy's office right it's around noon. It's been a day. Do I need this big of a brush? Do I really need this big of a brush for this little birdhouse? I, I walk in her <laughs> office, and I'm like, you know what? I, I just, I, I'm walking away from my computer right now. I just, I, I, I need a break. Yeah. Yeah. And then I said, I said, well, go get a cup of coffee and come sit in here with me for a little bit. Well, that means I got to make a pot of coffee. I'm like, well, I don't know what to tell you. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. Just sit down and take a break. Just come sit. And so he came and sat for like two minutes. No, I had to go get lunch. And then he went and got our lunch. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's been a day. It's, it's been, been a day. Yeah, it's, it's been, been a long one day. of those days where everything takes longer than you it's think supposed it's going to. to. Um, like it took us forever. We were messing with this, trying to figure out the technology on this and, um, things weren't working and then mm. things were, and, and then I'm like, well, maybe we should try the two camera thing, try to split the camera. Cause then the camera, the bottom camera that's on me, it doesn't have to be so far away. And that might be part of the issue of it's too far away and it's not focusing well, properly. 
and and then I like let it go and I walked away and I came back and then Tim was like getting everything prepped up. I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, well, didn't you just split the camera? I'm like, oh, oh, are we going to do that? <laughs> okay. Can you guys hear Chrissy better now? Oh, could you not hear me before? Yeah, it was on the, uh, the laptop and I just switched it to this camera. Oh, can you hear me? Can you hear me now? 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 Did you guys get a nice little peek of Tim's ear? Because Tim accidentally went live. Did you accidentally or did you do that on purpose? I did that on purpose. Because oh. I couldn't figure out how to get out of this <laughs> and back to the page. So I, instead uh, of just closing everything out, you're like, I'll just go live, start it, and end it. Yes. Okay. Yeah, I'll just start it, end it, and go back. Okay, they can hear me now. They can hear me now loud and clear. I like it. Yeah, Kathy said you were muffled earlier. It was muffled. Yeah, I, I switched the microphones. Tim probably did that on purpose. He's probably like, girl, hush your mouth. Yeah. No. You talk too much. Well, yeah. I... <laughs> At home, he wishes he had a mute button. <laughs> I keep I keep hitting it on a remote, hoping it'll work. It, it never does. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Never does. I'm tired. I'm so tired today too, y'all. I'm tired. It is one of those days. I had to go get a cup of coffee. I'm like, I got to like down some caffeine. I need some energy um, because I, I was feeling sluggish. I was feeling it. Feeling it. So yesterday, dad went and helped mom and dad went and helped mom and dad. <laughs> Tim went and helped mom and dad. Um, mom and dad are having um, some technology woes with their yes. computer. They've got the smart, not computer. Oh. With their TV. Yes. They have a smart TV. And um, my dad was trying to get on Netflix and it wasn't working. So Tim went over and got them all hooked up with their Netflix. Um, got them all hooked up. Yeah. How's it working, Dad? Are you still connected? Are you still on your Netflix? Let us know. Is it still working? Um, yeah. And I stayed home. You know, I should... <clears throat> I should show them how to put YouTube on it so they can watch you on the TV. It would be easier for them to just turn it on on the TV than try and do it on their phones, I yes. bet. Yes. Yes. Oh, Leslie says she likes the mics because then she can hear us both the same. One's not louder than the other because now Tim's probably quieter and further away, yep. right? Well, it's, yeah. I, uh, yeah. I probably could hook them up. We're just going to keep trying new things until we can just get it all perfected. Until we get it right. Until we can get it all just right. Yeah. We'll just keep trying new things. All right. I'm starting by doing them all different colors. We may bring in some colors. I will probably whitewash them a little bit, but we may, you know, bring a little mix just to kind of tie everything in together. I don't know yet. We'll see. We'll see. You don't know. Which size of vintage bonnets and carrier trio is new this year? I believe there were only two previously. Um, the minis are new this year. We had the large last year, and then we have the small this year. I think we just had the large last we year, didn't we? Last year. Um, we had different, like, smaller carrots last year, but the large were the ones that we originally had. Those are the same size, and then we added the smaller size and then the little minis. Karen says she likes the split screen. Yeah, it's, it's going to definitely take some getting used to, Miss Patricia. It's definitely going to take some getting used to. Um, but we'll kind of like see at the tail end, we'll like do like a little a vote after you've gotten to watch it for a little while and kind of gotten to like get used to it a little bit. We'll see what everybody thinks at the end of the live. Um, I definitely think you get a much better view of the craft. I think instead of just seeing it, from the front view on the table, you're seeing it directly overhead, and I think you're going to get a much better view. Miss Mary, hello. She says, nice to see both. Um, yeah, I think it's yes, nice Tammy, to see both see views. So, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Oh, let me see. Um, yeah, let me, I'll, I'll grab the. Need a little bit of a second coat on some of these. I'm going to post the, uh, uh, YouTube link. Yes. There. Yeah, we are on Facebook and that YouTube. Way if you want to. Facebook and YouTube. Did you send both links in the text? Yes. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, where did that go? The only problem is if I make a mistake, it's going. You all gonna. You all gonna see it. You're all gonna see it real good. There's gonna be no like covering and being like. Oops, that didn't happen. Yeah, Nancy, we're still doing Facebook. It's just we're, we're doing both. We're on now. Facebook and YouTube. So we are on Facebook right now. We're on both. Um, yes, we're definitely on both. So you can watch on either. Some people prefer one over the other. And that's okay. I'm going to jump back over here. All right. Yeah, that's the Facebook. Uh, Facebook looks good this, uh, today, too. Good. They're all coming in. Everything's that's, coming in. Good, nice. good, 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 good. Okay. Um, let me do a little bit more of this light blue. A little bit more. Thank you guys for sprinkling. Thank you. Miss Veronica the, says, I'm really liking. What this is the screen. darker yellow? The darker yellow is. Empire gold. Yep. Empire gold. Empire. Empire, Empire gold. records. That was I, a good movie. I use that one a lot in the fall. I haven't used it too much lately. Um, I saw it and I was like, ooh, that'll be fun. That'll be fun to mix into here. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, it seems like it's, uh, the split screen is trying to grow on some people. Yeah. Like really like Brenda it. says, I love that you can like click on some of those. I love, Brenda says, I love that you can see everything. I can see everything that you are, uh, are doing with the split screen. Getting my infusion, watching you guys keeps me busy. Well, I'm glad we can help keep you busy, Miss Brenda. I can watch on YouTube on my TV, but can't comment there. Oh, yeah, when you're on the TV, you can't comment on the TV. That's, that's but true. But you can yell at it. She does. That's true. Or you can have it on the TV and your phone, and then you can comment on your <laughs> comment on the phone and watch on the TV. Adding to my cart. Awesome. I like that yellow. Yes. It is a really, 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 really pretty, pretty yellow. Empire. Ooh, 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 where are y'all? <laughs> where are y'all? Empire gold. Empire gold. <laughs> it's good. Trust me, it's gonna take me a, a minute to get used to this too, y'all. It's gonna take me a minute. Um, definitely. Okay, so I'm going to come in with a little bit of a dry brush with the white, just a little bit. Um, these other brushes, I'm going to keep handy for a moment. Yes, Allison, we do. Uh, we see your comments. Hey, Allison. Will you be doing this all the time? Hard to get used to. Suzanne, I don't know. We're just today. I can't promise anything. We're just testing it out to see how it goes. Um, we wanted to try something new. We've had people mention in the past um, that they like a split screen. Um, so, but it's just been recently they've started to do it where you can stack it like this and they're not side by side. Um, and like a landscape view. It's like a portrait view. Um, so, I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be all the time. We'll see. See how everybody likes it. We're going to take a vote at the end to see how everybody likes it. So we may I, I try some other different things. I'll definitely have to be mindful of paying attention to that. Putting that the post oh. in the comments up, pin in the comments up there. Uh huh. Because it covers part of the craft. So, oh, let me see. Let me see. You have a comment pinned uh, up there. It covers part of the craft. Just don't leave it. Yeah. For a long time. <laughs> Not too bad, but yeah, yeah. Okay. And now. Now, I am going to remember I used those little birdies before we even released the little birdies. Um, I had two of them left over. So I'm going to use these two little birdies, I think, in this craft. So I'm going to go ahead and paint these. Um, probably. The, the, one light, one, one, one. the lighter the blue is the new blue that we have in the shop. It's called Blue Heaven. Blue Heaven. Yeah, we just added that one to the shop, I don't know, a couple weeks ago. Maybe not too long ago. We just added that one. They discontinued um, some of the old blues that we had. And so we were like, we need some more blue. We had like no blues in the shop. Um, so 
We added that, and then we added lake blue, which is a pretty blue, too. It is. It's a little bit like brighter. Tim, this is more like Tim's kind of color, very bright. This is very, like, beachy feeling to me. Um, so this could be good for summertime. Um, it's a little bit bold and bright for me, but um, it is still, it is very pretty. So we just added that one. I haven't used it yet. It still has the lid, the lid, the seal on the lid. Um, I haven't used it yet. All right, get ready, guys. I'm gonna grab some names here. All right. Hey, the blue bird of happiness. I'm dry brushing a little bit of blue on here. As long as they don't get rid of my favorite nightfall blue. <laughs> oh, nightfall blue y'all this one right here it is like my favorite too it is such a pretty pretty uh, blue it's, it's the blissful blue that was discontinued right blissful blue was discontinued and i loved that blue also loved it but if you take some white and you put a drop of nightfall blue in it you get like the identical blissful blue because the blissful blue and the nightfall blue went so perfectly together, but it's doesn't discontinue. We All right, we have now. Tammy Monroy, Candace Barrett, Patty Campbell, Sherry Lynn Hurtado, Shirley Crandall, Mary Winkler, Lavada Lownier Vance, Leslie Shanahan Myers, Bernita Tuttle, and Crystal Elliott. Crystal M. Elliott. So I'm just sanding around my edges here. Distressing it a little bit because y'all know I love a good distressed craft. I'm going over the white and the um the dry brushed white that just kind of like softens it a little bit and kind of helps blend your colors a little bit. But well, hello to our friends from the other side of the pond. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, Judy, a little bit of a different view today. What's distracting, Miss Tina? What's distracting? The craft? I'm sorry. Or are you just distracted? Um, I actually think you can see the craft a lot better. It's probably distracting because it's like it's a new view. And anytime there's something new, it's hard to get used to, you know? And I don't know that this will be new forever. We're just trying it. We're just seeing if we like it. Um, we don't know unless we try it, right? It's, it's like broccoli. It. You don't you don't know if you don't like it if you don't try it. Yeah, you don't know you like it until you try it. Right? You haven't tried it. Yes. Yes, Deborah, we have a split screen. We are trying something new. Um, so we'll see. Yes. Yeah. Isn't that in relation to uh, Patricia? I don't know. Oh. They could just have the same last name. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. Are you related to Miss Patricia? Are you Miss, uh, was it Debbie or Deborah? Deborah. I believe. I believe. No, it's the same heat gun I've been using. Um, you can get it at Lowe's or Amazon. It's the Wagner brand. Um, it's the lower wattage one of the two versions that they had at the time when I bought it. <laughs> Denise says you should be hand model. Well, my name, I know I was like, I really like y'all look, if you look closely, my nails chip in and this one's chip in. And I'm like, I really don't have the nails for this um, screen today, but we're just going to go with it. Because listen, when we're crafters, our nails get messed up, right? Um, I need to redo my nails. I was going to do them last night and I just, I didn't oh, have time. Deanna Siegel is on here. Who? Deanna. Diana. I'm like, Deanna Siegel? Who's Deanna Siegel? Diana! Hey, girl! My friend Sorry. Diana. Deanna's Diana's. They're two totally different names. Yeah. You ask someone with the name Deanna and someone with the name Diana, if they're That's the okay. same name, they're I, both going to say absolutely not. I've called Deanna Diana. <laughs> Veronica, Veronica says it's a good excuse to get a manicure on a weekly basis. Girl, listen, I, 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 I was going to do that. And I was like, I'm just going to go, I'm going to treat myself. I'm going to go get my nails done. I'm going to go every other week. I'm going to get my nails done. I'm going to, I'm going to do this. Okay. I was super excited and I went and I got my nails done. Then she had to pay for it. <laughs> and it was like 60 bucks. And I'm like, what? Cause they ask you all these questions. Like, do you want this? Do you want that? And I'm like, okay. Okay. You don't realize it's $5 for this, $5 for that, $3 for that. 
And because the first time I went, I had taken Elena to get her nails done for a dance at school. And I was like, I'll just get a little manicure and get some gel polish done. Girl, girl. And she's like, do you want your cuticles trimmed? Do you want the soak? Do you want to? I'm like, I don't know. Like, I thought that was all like, I thought that's what a manicure was. Like, There's I thought all that was included. There's that one. No, that, um... it wasn't all included. They upcharged me. There's there's that one comedian comedian that uh, oh, yeah. talks about getting your nails done. Yes. And oh, that's why you single. <laughs> that's why I'm single. That's why you're single. <laughs> that's why. Any French tips? Yes. Um, only five dollar more. Yeah, only five dollars. Only five dollar more. So, um, yeah. So. I got my nails done and I thought that was gonna be a good idea. I'm gonna go ahead and put paint or glue my rooftops onto my um, birdhouses cause they're galvanized metal and the metal takes a little bit longer to set than wood does. So that way we can leave these set. Um, yes, Allison, you know the one I'm talking about. I think everybody's is, probably heard that one, yeah. That skit is absolutely hilarious. It is funny, it is funny. And I mean, I'll admit there were a couple times where I was just like, uh-huh. <laughs> who knows i was selling my soul at that point because i had no clue what i was agreeing to um but it was like 60 dollars for me to get my nails done and then it was like a hundred dollars for elena's because she got like some fancy design she's like oh can you do this and they're like sure we can do that they don't tell you it's gonna be like a 30 dollar upcharge to do that fancy you know hand-painted design on there that she wants and um it was expensive it was expensive so then i was like it's okay I just won't do the full thing next time. I know better now. I know I'm just going to keep it simple, do the basics. But still, by the time they soak the nails off and they, they if, if, if you have them file and like shape the nail, they charge you for that. And I was like, this is ridiculous. You know, and it's like a 20 minute drive to the place. And then you got to sit there and wait for your appointment because you always seem to have to wait for your appointment. And then you have to get the nails done. And then you got to drive home. I'm like, I can just do this at home on a Sunday afternoon, um, which overall works pretty good. So I do my own nails. I do my own. I got bought all the stuff. And it just stinks the whole house up. It does stink up the whole house. But I'm, I'm doing it's it at home. It's me cooking cabbage. In my jammies while we're watching a movie or the football game or something. Yes. No, you you want short nails? That's that's why you're single. You need long ones to get a man. You need your long nails to get a man. Oh, you need long. Okay. Yeah. No, that's that comedian skit. If you guys have never seen it, it's super super funny. Super funny. They should have everything included, right? They should everything right. It should all be included. Yes, Linnea. Yes, she says it should, everything should be included, like taking off the nails and your toes and everything and your cuticles and all that. One price. I just want the out the door pricing. I want the bell tire out pricing the door for nails. Pricing. Yes, I want. What is my out the door pricing? Don't up charge me all the things, because because. Because I'll get all the things and then well, I'll have to yeah. pay for all the things. Be careful with your glue because you don't have your paper down. I know. I know. I'm being risky. I don't have paper down. I and mean, Matt does not like gel super glue. It, it likes to stick to it. But um, these are not super, super tiny pieces. So I feel like I can control it a little bit. So I'm, yes, I'm, Lana, she wants the cash, cash price. Oh, give me the cash, cash price. I love a cash. Give me a good cash, cash price. Cash, cash. Cash, cash. Should we tell the cash, cash story? I feel like we have a lot of new friends here that haven't heard the cash, cash story. Hearts, if you think we should tell this cash, cash story. See if I can remember the whole story. That was a funny story. Yes. It was me and my, my the squirrels running in my brain that day. Um, <laughs> cash, cash. Okay, I see some hearts, so we're going to go for it. So, cash, cash story. So, Tim decided that he wanted gutter guards on the house. He decided he was done climbing on ladders to clean the gutters. Because someone's not crazy about me getting up on the roof anymore. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. So I support that, okay? But I also know, you know, when you call these people and say, come on out and give me a price, you got to brace yourself, right? Um, There's four different prices, and I didn't help. So we know, we, we know a lot about, like, sales because, like, one, you know, my dad had his own business and he, you know, would quote jobs. You know, I learned a lot from him through the years. 
I worked at an auto auction. Um, that was my one of my first jobs as a teenager. I knew a lot of the car salesmen, so I know a lot of their tactics and their tricks and their lingo and the way they the, the way they sell things. We had um, two boys who were um, worked sales jobs, and they practice their training on us. So we know all well, the things. Unheard. Okay. We know all the things. Okay. You know, yes, right here. And look at this and look at this and let's go, let's go walk over here and let's look at this and let's, you know, all the things. Okay. We know all the tips, tricks, tips and tricks to the trade. Right. So they come and I'm like, I really don't want to stay here forever with this person. Like, could you just bring me out when it comes time to price? I don't need to hear the whole sales pitch. Of course, he has to give us the whole sales pitch. Okay. Um, all right. So these are going to dry and we're going to bring in our base. So for our base, I think we're going to add a little antique wax and then we're going to heavily dry brush some white. I kind of want it to be like light and airy, not too dark, but I feel like it needs, well, maybe we won't antique wax it. Maybe we'll just dry brush the white. And just let the natural wood color show through. I think we'll do that. That's what we're gonna do. All right, get ready, guys. I'm gonna grab some more names here in a second. I gotta bring my white paint back in here. Okay. Um, so so he's like pulling out his stuff and he's showing us his samples and he's telling us all the reasons why we must have these gutter guards in our life how it's going to save his life. My husband's life will not be in danger anymore. Um, all the things, right? They're like pulling at the heartstrings, selling this, okay? And so then it comes to we're gonna, comes to price, okay? Um, and I'm like, I know the first price is not the lowest price. I know they're going to, I'm going to try not to give away all the tricks and, 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 but you know, cause you know, it's, it's their livelihood. And, but I always know there's wiggle room for these things. Right. And so he gives us the price and I'm like, mm. like I knew it was going to be high, but that's ridiculous. Uh, that's not happening. I'm like, I'm playing a hard ball. I'm playing, you know, the wife that's going to like be stubborn and, and Tim's the whole, like, Tim's like, yeah, let's do it. Yeah. I want I these gutter guards. I don't have to get on a roof. Where do I sign? And I'm like, oh, pump the brakes, pump the brakes, dude. Um, that's insane. That's the, absurd. The pellets came from Dollar Tree. Yep. These are from Dollar Tree. And I'm hoping this is going to work, y'all. I'm hoping this, these are going to be our base and I'm hoping it's going to work. We'll find out together. Sometimes we, we, we learn together around here. Yeah. It's, I, I was in construction for 20 years and I've, I've fallen off a few ladders and a few roofs. Yes. And I don't know if I can take any more of those falls. Yeah. So he, um, he gives us his price. I'm like, no, not, it's, it's not happening. <laughs> no, no, that's not happening. So then he comes down a little bit. And I'm like, yeah, that's still not happening. That's still not happening. So then I'm like, okay. I said, well, he's like, well, how are you going to pay? Are you going to be financing? Are you going to pay cash? Are you going to, you know? And I'm like, oh, we can pay cash. We, we can do cash. We're not going to finance. We'll just, we'll pay cash. It's done. You know, that's, we just prefer to save up, pay cash and to not have lines of credit and stuff like that. We just try to avoid that in life if we can, um, try to try not to have, to have as little debt as possible. So we're like, nope, nope. We've saved up for this. We've budgeted for this. We, you know, we're going to pay cash. And he's like, okay, well, I guess if you're not going to have the finance charges and stuff, that'll take down this percent and, and this and that. And he's like got, writing all these numbers. And I know he already has a number in his head. He's already got a bottom line number in his head, you know. Um, but, you know, he wants to try to get it as high as he can, right? Because that's his job and it's his livelihood. And, you know, and that's fair. You know, let's meet in the middle somewhere where we're, we're all happy. And he, uh, so he, he gives me a number. Well, he actually like writes the number down on a piece of paper and he goes, well, that was when I said no. And he said, well, okay, you said you're going to pay cash. And I'm like, yeah. He's like, you'll have, you know, have cash that day when they come out. Yeah. And, and I go, well, and he's like, okay. So we settle on a price. Okay. That we're all happy with. We can all live with. And then I go, well, so 
when they come out, we got to have cash. I said, but like, like cash, cash. And he's like, cash, cash. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, like, like cash, cash, like cash, cash. And he's like looking at me like I've done lost my mind. I'm like, like cash, we got to have cash. And he's like, well, oh, he's like, well, a check will be fine. <laughs> and I'm like, listen, I grew up with a lot of people in the trades and, 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 and I know a lot of people, like if it's cash, cash and not a check that has to be deposited into the bank, if it's cash, sometimes it's a little bit of a different story. So cash, cash and check are not the same thing. No. They're not the same. Cash is cash. A check is a check. It's not cash. A check, a check is, is a not cash, trial. you know, but in lingo, it's yes, it can be considered cash, a check, but to me, it's not, it's not the same. Um, so I'm sitting here negotiating with the guy and it's like the cash, cash price, <laughs> cash, cash. That's what I was looking for was the cash, cash price, not the check. <laughs> I was looking for the cash, cash price. And he like looked at me like I had like two heads, two heads. Yes. Yeah. So cash, cash. So that's a running joke around here. Um, cash, 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 cash speaks volumes. <laughs> so yes, our cash, cash. Right, check is not good until it clears the bank, right? Check is not cash. It's very different. It's paper trail. Very different, yes. Yeah. All right, I got some names for us. We have Alexis Pennington, Joanne George, Janice Keller O'Neill, Patty Campbell. Janice! Sorry. Cheryl Johnson. Hey, girl. Ruby Phillips and Patricia Matanis. Janice is one of the ladies... Um, we grew up in the neighborhood together and Janice is one of the ladies that used to come to my craft nights at my house when I used to host little craft nights for my family and friends um, before we started this page. Um, so she used to come and craft with us for a fun craft nights. It's been a long Ooh. time since we've done that. Janice Keller. Yeah. The Kellers down the street. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. You never met them. Well, you, you met, while well, you were there, you, Tim would go hide in the living room when we had our craft night, or he would like hide, go head up to the bedroom and hide up there for the night, um, or go out to the garage or or something. He was not wanting to be anywhere too near all nope. of the, the crafty ladies. Nope. <laughs> all right. Yes, don't forget to sprinkle this video because we're going to gift the set of birdhouses away to somebody um, in a little bit here. So. Don't you forget. Charging your dang computer. Is my, my, my computer dying? My computer battery failing? All right. I think that's good. I think that's good. I am going to paint one of these barbecue skewers because I think it'd be cute to do little perches. So we're just going to add a little bit of a little bit of white to this. And we'll just cut them to length when we want to glue our little perches in. This is just a barbecue skewer from Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree ones work really good in these little holes. I am. I want to get a, a, all the things put on another computer that's just going to stay in here. Well, we just, yeah, we could get an extra cord to keep in here. No, I'm going to do Lana that. says, and look how far it's come. A long way from his comfy chair, right? His recliner that he used to always sit and uh, um, watch us in. Son of a, yeah. you got to be kidding me. What? You don't have any cords. You don't have anywhere to plug it in. No. Well, did the battery... Does it, is it, oh, it's going to die. How low is it? The warning no. came on. Oh, we got a little bit of time. We got a little bit of time. I hope, otherwise we'll lose it because everything goes through the computer. Okay. All right, I got to get to this, y'all. I got to okay. focus. We're gonna, well, what? we're going to lose the overhead for a second. No, you uh, might not be able to reconnect it. Yes, I will. Oh, y'all. Bear with me. Okay, I'm just going to dry this. So if we lose you for a second overhead, then you're not losing anything. We're just drying. That's all we're
There. Can you hear me now? 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 I can see it because nobody can hear me now. Oh, no, they can, they, they can hear you. Sure. Yeah. La, 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 yeah. la. Oh, man. They can hear you. Okay. Oh, man. You all could hear my beautiful singing, a beautiful singing voice. Okay. All right. So I'm going to use these Jenga blocks as little spacers behind the craft with little spacers okay let me glue my sticks together let me glue my sticks together glue my sticks together i'm just gonna use some hot glue use some hot glue get it going come on come on come on oh my oh. don't you hate that when you leave your glue gun plugged in for a long time and your glue just all melts and drips out did you know that glue guns are supposed to drip they're supposed to drip. So if your glue gun drips, don't be like, oh, this glue gun stinks or something wrong with it. Glue guns are designed to leak. They're supposed to leak. That's why they come with that little tray to catch the drippies. Because um, if they don't drip, then the glue just burns inside. They want it to drip so that the glue keeps flowing. But if you're like me, you plug in your glue gun for an hour before you go to use it. And by the time you go to use it, half of it's dripped out on you, right? All right. Sherry says, this is a great idea. I'm going to create this craft. Awesome. I love that. All right. Let's get our birdhouses back in here. All right. So we're going to start gluing our bases on. I'm going to glue the base right onto the back. Of the birdhouse first so i can make sure that it's um lined up in a way that you can't see it make sure it's all centered in there like so and then we're going to glue i actually really like the overhead view for you guys because i feel like you guys can really get a much better view of what i'm actually doing all right we're gonna put our little birdhouse on like that these are shims these are construction shims these are actually pretty nice construction shims these are the um we had to get them at the local hardware store they didn't have like just the one regular ones you get like home depot and stuff these are cedar shims but i actually really like them they're a little more expensive but you get um a much better quality there's not as many you know you always get a bunch of broken ones and some crappy ones um these actually are really good quality shims so i like them but yes they are shims you could use a yard stick you could use um some paint stir sticks glued together you could use um they have something that's called lath i'm gonna kind of do these a little hey Jen. some of these a little wonky on purpose i should have did that first one a little wonky but i did it perfectly straight but we'll do these ones a little wonky um you can see this was a test cut. Yours will not come with random weird etching on the back. Um, this was the test cut that I approved. So Tim, usually when he does test cuts, he'll use scrap um, pieces. So that's why there's weird designs on the back. Okay. So we're just gluing them on, gluing them on, gluing them on. All right, now that we've been live for a while, how are you guys liking the uh, how are you liking the the two camera view? Cheryl says, "Love this craft." Awesome. Can you move the comments because they're not moving? Yeah, you got them all frozen up on me. And then we're gonna get to the tricky part in a minute here, y'all. We're gonna get to the tricky part, um, the base. And I'm hoping my base is big enough and solid enough to hold this tall craft. We'll see. If not, we're going to figure out a way to make the base work or to make a different base work. But before we get off this live, you will know a good base for this. All right, I'm going to do this one a little, a little wonkied, a little wonky. Robin says, love it with the two views. Kathy says, really oh. liking it. Love the two views. Um... Lisa's here. Lisa Marie. I can't. Oh, hey, Lisa. Hello, girl. Hello. All right. 
All right, there's how we're looking. How stinking cute is that? How cute. So now we got to do our base, okay? I'm going to hold up here, Tim. Oh, oh, shoot. I should have put my birdhouse higher. Ah, oh, shiminy crickets. Shiminy? Shiminy crickets. That's all right. Shim, shiminy, shim, shiminy. I'm going to pop this off. I didn't leave room for my base. <laughs> I didn't leave room for my base, y'all. It's okay. I just put the glue on. Ah, uh, Sierra said to, to say hi. She loves watching. Oh, hey, awesome. Sierra. She is just a little sweetheart. Okay. We're just going to move this up. It's awesome bit. seeing her uh, growing up. Let's put that there. But apparently she has. Apparently she is just like her mom. When her mom was younger. <laughs> oh, yes, Wendy, we did get the gutters. And we got the cash, cash price. We got the cash, cash price. We got the cash, cash price. We did get the gutters. Yes. And they're great. Tim has not had to go up and clean the gutters no, since then. I have not had to be so, back on that roof. So it's, I am it's, so happy. It was a good investment. And that was two years ago-ish. <sighs> Something like that. Yes. Okay. All right. So my plan is to put one in the back. One in the front and hopefully create a big enough, solid enough base that it stands. Okay. So I'm going to kind of test this out here and see. Is it going to work? Ooh, that's kind of. Kind of what? Tall. Well, I know, I know it's, a, it's, listen, it's risky business around here. Okay. Sometimes oh, yeah. we take risks, so oh, you don't have risk. to take the risk. Um, but I'm thinking I'm going to test it before okay. I glue it. I'm going to take a little bit of painter's tape and just tape around it and see if it free stands the way we want it to before I start gluing it. And then I got to pull the glue apart. Okay. So we're going <laughs> to test it. She said, I'm mommy of many. <laughs> yes. Yes. Sierra is just like her mommy when her mommy was little. Sierra is, um, Lisa is, remember we had mentioned that Tim was walking his friend's daughter down the aisle? Well, that was Lisa. And um, Sierra is Lisa's little girl. And um, yes, we knew Lisa at that age or maybe slightly older. Um, um, you might have known her at that age. She was, I think, yeah. was slightly older when I met her. Um, but gosh, she's just like her mama. You know the curse of like, <laughs> I hope you have oh, a yeah, child just yeah, like that you. Parental curse. Yes, I think her daddy gave her that curse back in the day. I think so. <laughs> We're gonna blame it on her daddy. No, we'll, okay. We'll blame. We'll blame Larry. Let's see. It's gonna be glued. Everything's gonna be straight. Definitely have to wear. The mic, okay. so we hear Tim. Okay, we will. We will yep. make sure. Okay. Okay. I think we're gonna be good. It's a little front heavy. It wants to lean forward a little bit. Um. So if we could weigh down the back a little bit, um, I'm thinking right now how we can do that. I have another idea. I have another idea. Rose, we'll be praying for you. And just uh, you know, do what they do what the doctor says and get better. I think if we create a bigger base, separate these, and put a couple Jenga blocks, but then how do you hold it? Hold on, we're gonna figure this out, y'all. We're gonna figure this out. Right, let me think. <laughs> Give me a moment to think. Tim, entertain them while I think. Entertain them? <laughs> entertain them, Tim. Yeah. Hello, my honey. Hello, my baby. Hello, my rape time gal. What if you... No. I don't know. I'm going to grab some names is what I'm going to do. I'm open to suggestions. It just needs a little bit more weight in the back. Because it just wants to go forward a little bit. What? It needs a little more junk in the trunk. Yes, it so needs a been, little more junk in the trunk. Everybody's trying to get rid of the junk in the trunk. I know. Here, you want to add it? I don't know. Everyone's yeah. trying to make it the big booties these days. And I'm like, I don't want a big booty. Just give me a nice little booty. I want a little booty. My booty's big enough. I don't need a big booty. Um, Yeah. Okay. All right. 
I'm gonna grab some oh, names girl. here. Get it together. Oh, what if we go? We have Vernie Winters. What if we go? And Bell, Rhea Moore, Dorothy Daughtry, Sherry Lynn, Ari Hurtado, Marcia Bourne, Denise Curtis, and Janice Keller O'Neill. I think I've got it, y'all. I think I've got it, y'all. I think we need to go. Oops, sorry. I hit y'all. <laughs> I think we need to go like pinch it at the front. And that's going to give it, it's still going to be super cute and kind of feel very, it feels kind of like beachy nautical. Um, uh, get what I'm doing. Get where I'm going. I'm picking up what you're putting picking down. Picking up what I'm putting down. I think, and then we just got to glue it in there. <laughs> you have my granddaughter asking, why do you need a big booty? I know, right? Why? Why? I, I want to know the same thing. Why do people want big booties? Wait, I don't, I don't know why, but people want big booties. Somehow I clicked on a video on um, Reels, and it was something about someone doing some booty exercise. It was one of those, I don't know, just a random video. And maybe for a minute, I thought I was going to, like, work out again and start exercising. And then all of a sudden, that's all my news feed was filled with was all these booty building exercises. And I'm like, y'all, that's not for me. That's not for me, Facebook. You don't know me that well. All right. Everyone's like, just get it together. Get it together. Figure it out. I'm going to figure it out. I'm stalling. <laughs> I'm stalling. Um, I feel like there's a better solution than that. Where's my, my little Jenga's? Well, yeah, but you got to try and still do it underneath the camera because. Sorry, y'all. Sorry. Sorry. Because that camera is like, too high. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well. I only have two hands here. <laughs> I only have two hands. Maybe I put a support there. Well, I put next a support time, there. If you're doing a tall project, we need to raise that camera up some. Yes. 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 Okay. I just want it to be secure. I don't want it to be like flimsy. So I'm trying to think of a secure way of doing it. People are like, yeah, you should have figured it out before you went live with it. Well, that's not how we do it here. Around here, we figure it out as we go. Well, maybe we just need more space. Use Tim's hands. More space. I know, right? Because Tim's got... I don't know. I like the... I think we just need to widen the base a little bit. That could be. That could be. That could be. Because if we put a couple Jenga blocks... In the, front, in the front and the back and the back it'll make our base a little bit wider to give us a little bit more stability oh, give it a whirl can you grab me two more jenga blocks i'm going to tape it to be sure again we're going to tape it where's the where they're um here's one um they're in the little bed of that little truck there i just need one more what color lighter uh, the lighter color one Yes, a wider base. Yeah, I don't think we need a heavier base. I mean, a heavier base would certainly work, but I think the biggest thing is we need it to be wider. We're a little top heavy. A little top heavy. A little top heavy. So we need to, to lose a little weight in the, well, we can't lose weight in the top, but we need to gain a little weight at the bottom. <laughs> we need a bigger booty. All right, let's see. Now, it's not going to be perfect because it's not glued, but... I need a third hand. Where? I don't know. I just. Here. Really? Yep. Seriously? Yep. Y'all. It's your fault we had pizza. Okay, let go. You suggested it. Okay, that's better. That gives more stability. Okay. And if you like make yours excessively tall and spread them out further, you might want to double your Jenga blocks in the middle. Okay. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do, y'all. That's what we're going to do. See, around here, we come up with solutions to the problems. Yes. Not only do we come up with the problems. Yes. We create the problems and then we come up with a solution to it. Got that. Got two. Oh, wait. Did I have it that way? You had it that way. This is the way I originally had it. 
I wanted to go this Ooh. way. Lania is, uh, she says she, she may not be able to make a craft night this, this mm -hmm. month because she's going to a special Olympics basketball tournament in Odessa, Ooh, girl. Texas. That's are awesome. you playing or are you watching? Are you, are you an athlete or are you watching the game this, for this event? That's pretty awesome. Okay. Our Jenga block song. Do this, do this, do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this, do this, do this. All right, put a little hot glue. Try and keep our face straight. Oh, she's an athlete and she does individual skills. It's awesome. Fun. Well, good luck Holy to cow. you. I hope it. Like... This is a tall craft. Everything gets in the way. Everything gets in the way. All right, I'm just making sure I got my base level. All right, now we're gonna glue the front down and just hope and pray that it works in real life. It worked with the glue, with the tape, so. It worked with the tape, so. So let's, let's. And we got a couple little birdies we can add too. I didn't add, I didn't add her birdies. All right. All right I'm gonna hold this for a second. It seems to be standing, y'all. It seems to be standing. Linnea. What a pretty name. What a pretty name. Oh, okay. Oh, I said Linnea. Uh, Miss Cindy used to coach track and field for Special Olympics. That's awesome. Okay. Yay, it's standing. It's standing. It's standing. It's standing well. Okay, let's add our little birdies and our little perch. Perches. Or perches. Perches? Perches. perches. Add our little perch. Oh. Okay. I'm going to cut just a little. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what? One battery time. Oh, that's right. I don't think it was even doing that much. Okay, I'm just going to. Oh, it uh, says it's her niece. That's awesome. Oh, just, that's awesome. Okay. Just got a little hot glue. Do another one. Don't cut your fingers. These scissors work uh, really great. Tammy, these are from our shop. Yep. Let me grab the shop link. Glue. glue. And I'm telling you, the Dollar Tree barbecue skewers are perfect little perch pieces for these little birdhouses. A little bit of hot glue. And stick it right in. Yeah, I, I posted the, uh, I think I did. Yeah. Thank you, Miss Dorothy. Thank you. All right. Little hot glue all the way around. Or is it uh, Ivy Garland climbing the pole would be cute right That around. would be cute. A little Ivy Garland. That would be cute. I do have a couple little birds. I think, let's see. This little bird, we might sit down here on our little edge. Like he's standing on the little, um, like he's standing down here. So let's attach this little guy. A little hot glue on the back. And the birds come in a set of four, but I used two of them on this craft right here um so we had two left over so i'm using them on this one and then let's see let's put this one maybe up here maybe up here yeah put it up here put it up at the top Laxo, Laxo, Laxo. Pippa says, uh, this is delightful. Wish you soldier stuff in the UK. I know. Maybe someday. Maybe someday. <laughs> Don't forget, someone who sprinkles this video, we will be gifting to someone. It has to be in US, US or Canada. Um, but we will be gifting a set of these birdhouses to somebody. Um, how cute is that? Super cute. I'm going to try to show you up close. Do, 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 do. 
can't go low enough. We'll go this way. We'll go this way. There's our little top one. <laughs> <laughs> that one, <laughs> that one. We're figuring it out, y'all. We'll figure it all out together. And that's what our base, how we did our base at the bottom. But it stands all on its own. It's pretty solid. Pretty solid. So um, isn't that fun? Isn't that fun? Love it, love it, love it. Um, so we are going to gift this set to someone. You can probably go back to one camera now. Um, because we're done crafting. One. Yes, that way Let's they see. can get full, fill us all, fill in the whole thing. Wrong. Right. The other one, <laughs> the other one, <laughs> the other one. Let there me. we go. There we go. Okay. All right. So here, I'll show you guys again without. I'm still learning it. How stinking cute is that? Super, super fun. Super cute. Um, We are going to gift these birdhouses. All you had to do to be eligible, you still can real fast, is share this video. Let us know in the comments that you did. And um, we're going to pick somebody right now. What we're going to do is Tim is going to scroll through the comments on that screen over there. I'm not going to look at it. When I tell him to stop, he will stop. And that is the person who will be gifted the um, the birdhouses. He'll write down a little note for us. Okay, you ready? Oh, hold on. Right, get your sticky notes. Get your sticky notes ready. All right. That's thank you, Veronica. Thank you, Jerry. Uh, thank you, Miss Tama. Thank y'all. Y'all are awesome. Thank you. Thank you. All right, All right. ready? Yep. All right, here we go. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Keep those names a rolling. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. A winner. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Keep those names a rolling. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. A winner. Stop. In the name of love, before you break my heart, think it all over, think it all over. <laughs> all right, who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Sticky notes. Sticky notes. Uh, sticky sticky notes. notes. <laughs> I didn't grab it. We have Miss. Well, you didn't Ms. grab the side that was sticky. I didn't. We have Miss Sheila Bison. Bison? Bison? Miss Sheila. Miss Sheila Bison. Um, send us an email. Christie's team at Christie'sCraftroom.com. And say, hey, I won the set of birdhouses. And here's my address. Okay. Make sure you all let us know in the... Um, in the email what you're sending for because it just helps us helps us to narrow it down um so say hey i won the birdhouse set here's my address okay um and we will get it sent out to you miss sheila bison 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 i'm probably saying it wrong sheila's still here yay all right congratulations miss sheila shoot us an email we will get um a set of these set aside for you and just get us your address and we'll get them shipped out to you, okay? Um, this one is super cute. Can't wait to see how you craft it. Well, we just showed how we crafted it. So make sure you go back and watch the replay because we went through the whole steps of how to craft it um, just now. So as soon as we end this, you can refresh your page. You can rewatch the replay and see how we did it, okay? Um, so thank you guys for watching. Thanks for hanging out. And we will see you very soon. We love you guys. You guys have a great rest of your night. Bye, guys.